Ecclesiastes chapter 3. Ecclesiastes chapter 3. This is what God's Word says. For everything there is an appointed time, an appropriate time for every activity on earth. A time to be born and a time to die. A time to plant and a time to uproot what was planted. A time to kill and a time to heal. A time to break down and a time to build up. A time to weep and a time to laugh. A time to mourn and a time to dance. You may be seated. Today's sermon is entitled Dance in Advance. So how many of y'all know that when we look at situations, sometimes they can get us depressed? We can start to look at our circumstances in such a way that the enemy will keep feeding stuff and just keep and we'll get down in the dumps. Say it. Waiting on God to bless us. And we just get in and oh Lord, woe is me. Oh Lord, woe is me. See, here's what's strange about that. Back before most of us got saved, we didn't do that. We found a way to dance in advance. Let me tell you, maybe y'all wouldn't like me, but see, back in my clubbing days. I used to pride myself on being a good dancer. In fact, when I went out and I hit the floor, I knew that I looked good. I knew what I, I, I knew. And you know what? Because I practiced in advance. I get in the mirror and get that move right. So I didn't have to look at my feet. I knew what my feet were. Amen. That's how I that's how I know the audience do it too. You can all tell the folks that don't practice, they down there look at their feet. Yeah. Hey, Brady, if, you, if you know what you're doing, you have to look at your that's feet. It. That's it. <laughs> hey, dance the room. Find a way to dance. We would dance in advance. Before we hit the club, we had to know we look good. In fact, you check yourself in the mirror, come down, and decide we go in the back room and sneak into the, to the big mirror. Amen. We had to be prepared for when we went out. Because we didn't want to go out there and look like fools. If we all saw them folks. <laughs> Somebody should have told them not to get out today. <laughs> Y'all know what I'm talking about. You should look in the mirror for yeah. you know. But you knew you were sharp. Yes, sir. Oh. So when I went out, I would stand and make sure I, I danced the dance so my moves were right, make sure everything was right. So when I asked the young lady to dance, oh, oh she was gonna be like, dance, yeah. dance. <laughs> I had a move going on. Whoa, what's up? Yeah, it's that little. Huh? It was the same when I stepped in my fraternity. You know, the cues were known for stepping, you know. Huh. <laughs> I was to practice hard. So when the step show came and the crowd was around, I could do that fancy stuff, spin around and do all kinds of things. Man, they were like, man, brother, you can step. Boy, they didn't see all the practice I did before I got there. Amen? See, sometimes that what happens to us is we're trying to wait for God's blessing before we dance. We try, well, when God blesses me, I'm going to praise him. Huh? That's not how you do it. See, if you want God to bless you, you need to dance before he blesses you. Yes. See, the one thing you need to understand is the enemy is out there, and he wants to keep you depressed. He wants to get you all wrapped up in what's going wrong, because he knows if you start dancing before the Lord, mighty things are going to happen. How many of you know that when you dance before God, he's going to pour down blessings? Thank you. And see, we need to understand that. In life, we go through seasons and situations. See, God doesn't do things according to our calendar. He does things according to seasons. And as he looks at seasons, he goes, this time and season is for this, and this time and season is for that. Greater Webster last year was a time of mourning. Amen? It was. Let's be real. It was a time of mourning. But the word says it's a time to mourn, and then it's a time to dance. This is our year to dance. Thank you. This is our year to dance. This is our year to dance. This is our year to get out and shout about how great God is to us. This is our year to stand up off our blessed assurance and let God know what's happening. We need to start dancing in advance for the blessings He's getting ready to give us. See, back in the old days, when they, they were sent to the tribe of Judah first, and Judah means praise. That means before the battle started, they were praising God and thanking Him for the victory before it happened. Amen? Amen. So you can't wait till it happens. 
you got to dance before it happens. See, God's already given you the victory. Some of us are waiting on healing. Why aren't you dancing? Dance in advance. Some of us are waiting for financial blessings. Dance in advance. Some of us are waiting for things to happen in our relationship. Dance in advance. Your husband's not doing what he's supposed to do. Dance in advance. Wife not doing what she's supposed to do. Dance in advance. Stop waiting. For God to move, he's already moved. If you ask the prayer as according to his will, guess what? It's already happened. It's already done. Start dancing. How many of y'all have financial situations you're worried about? Come on. How will you start dancing in advance? You want God to move, dance. Show him, yes, Lord, I'm dancing already. I'm not waiting for it to happen. Last conference here is over, brand new conference here. I'm, that's what I started doing this week at annual conference. When they were saying, Pastor's bringing all, I was dancing up to the offer. Because I realized, you know, every time I put an offering up here, this is going to be a blessing to my church. Amen? I decided to dance in advance. Thank you. I decided to stop waiting on God to bless me and dance now huh. for the blessings he's going to give me. So if we wait, we're going to be waiting. Yes. And we're going to let the enemy Same. get in control and let the enemy get us depressed. Let, oh my God, Same. look away. Who cares what it looks like? Same. Get up and dance. Yes. If God has done anything for you right now, you should already be on your feet <laughs> dancing right now. Amen? Amen. Yeah. Stand on your feet. Huh. Let's dance a little bit up in here. It's time for us to stop thinking about what used to be and start giving God His glory. It's time for us to start dancing in advance. We can't enter the new season looking back at the old one. We gotta let it go behind us and say, it's done, it's over. I'm looking forward. Okay, they treated you bad last year. All right, whatever. Dance now because God's getting ready to bless you. Okay, the finances were funny back then, but God's getting ready to pour out blessings for you. Dance right now for him. Amen. Yes, sir. See, the problem is we don't rejoice. We want to wait until the season. Hey, we, we got a club up here in the church. This is called Club Greater Webster. So we just start dancing before the Lord every time we come in. When we give off, we need to dance up and give them off. When we have altar call, we need to dance up to altar call. When folks come to the Lord, we need to be dancing about this thing. Because that's how God's going to bless us. The reason that God heard David's cry is because David wasn't afraid to dance. In fact, he danced so much he start throwing clothes on. Like Nelly, it's getting hot in here. Yeah. Amen? Amen? See, we want folk to come to church, but we want to set ourselves on fire. We need to bring up the heat up in here, up in here. That's what has to happen with the Webster. We've got to set ourselves on fire so God can move in our midst. The young people want to see us dance. They always laugh at you know, my kid. They say, Dad, oh, yeah. hey, but you know what? They know I still got it. <laughs> Amen? Amen. Let's stop acting like we're old and start showing, giving God the glory he deserves and dance in advance. Some of y'all need to dance right now. Thank you. Some of y'all need to take a little side step. Come on, everybody do a little side step. Come on, everybody do a side step. Yeah. There we go. We got it. Y'all know that y'all know. Yeah. We need to dance in advance. God's getting ready to bless us up in here. See, we, 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 got, we become Methodists so we can get sophisticated. We don't realize Methodists used to be the Holy Roman. We used to be the folks that brought the Spirit down to the church. We need to get back to that. God's Spirit has got to move in our church, and the only way we do it is to dance in advance. We need to let God know that we love Him. We need to let God know we really care by dancing for the Lord. I promise you, if you dance in advance, He's going to pour out blessings. If you, as you give and you dance, God's going to pour out blessings. As you love on folks and dance, God's going to pour out blessings. We need to start learning how to dance. The organist starts to play, and we need to start getting that shout on. Hallelujah. See, in right. church folk wonder why people shout, you don't know what God has done for them. Because when I think of the goodness of the Lord and what he's done for me, I can dance, 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 dance all night. It's time for us to dance before God. It's time for us to forget about the past and move forward. It's time for us to forget about the mess and get into the message. Forget about the test and get into the testimony. God wants to move. Dance in the band. Amen. Thank you. We're going to pray now. Are you all ready for this year? This is going to be a great year. I'm telling you it's going to be a great year. God has already shown it to me. But he's going to give us 
Only what we need to know right now. You need to dance. When you start getting down this year, I want you to start dancing. And if you see somebody getting down and not dancing, you grab them and say, come on, let's dance together. Let's make it happen. Yes, sir. Read, how many of y'all do the line dances? Oh, man. Let's do a line dance for the Lord. Amen. Oh, man. It's time for us to start doing it for God and not somebody else. Oh, if we start dancing in advance, God is going to pour out blessings thank like you. we've never seen before. Yeah. God is getting ready to do it up in here, up in here. Thank you. Yeah. Be part of it. Huh. Amen. Amen. Let's pray.